the highly anticipated finals of the Nigerian Bankers Games concluded over the weekend, bringing to a close another thrilling season of sporting excellence. The competition, which saw participation from various banks across the country, witnessed a display of exceptional athleticism, camaraderie, and sportsmanship. The games, which spanned five weeks, saw bankers from across the country showcase their athletics prowess and sport and spirit. According to the organizer of the event, the event is to balance between work and healthier lifestyle in sports. For us, Bankers Games has been going strong and stronger, excited. Finals now, just playing behind me there between uh, women like and first bank, you know, so they're going to have a winner. You know, but for us, it's just exciting to see that we get stronger bankers are bonding, knowing themselves, winning really relationships, and it's exciting. You know, it's a world where it has to balance between work, you know, and, um, and um, having fun. Work -life. Nottingham Forest forward Taiwo Awani has had groin surgery that will rule him out of action for months. Awani aggravated a groin injury while playing for Nigeria during this month's international break. The 26-year-old signed from Union Berlin for a then-club record fee of £17 million in 2022. has scored 15 goals in 39 games in all competitions for Forest in the last two seasons. I mean, while a Kitty State boxer has lamented the lack of boxing facilities in the state and appealed to a Kitty State governor to come to their aid. The boxer made this appeal at this month's Kitty Boxing Championship where they called on the government for urgent attention over the dilapidated boxing ring, which has been abandoned and lacks training kit needs. In his speech, the sports philanthropist and enthusiast Israel Adeshoka said boxing stakeholders should come together to promote boxing in the state. He said a newly introduced monthly boxing showdown was in partnership with the enviable and remarkable passion and vision of the state governor, Biodun Uyebanji, towards sports. Three boxers here yeah, know the way it is. Number one, our training arena, we don't have a good place to train. Number two, our ring, we don't have a ring. But boxers need a ring purposely because if we do not master the ring at home, to go to outside to fight will be difficult for us. We need the ring. And the equipment, in, uh, inavailable of training equipment, and some other things, lack of amenities that we need as a boxer personally. We are talking of boxing bag, pad, glove. Then train kids yeah, generally. That's a pretty a challenge mostly we are facing. I I know the government have an agenda for indoor sports. And if in fact in general, all sports in the district. And he has promised to do a lot of things that I can mention. But the little we can do we only complement whatever the government is. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.